Praise the Lord Church. Today's Bible meditation is taken from 2 Samuel chapters 17 and 18 and Acts chapter 4. If you're new to Living God family, a very warm welcome to you in Jesus' name. Hope this video will be a blessing to you as you hear and listen to the thoughts as we read through the Bible together. I encourage you to read the chapters during your personal devotion time and become recipients of listening to God's voice daily. 2 Samuel chapter 18 verse 33 And the king was deeply moved and went up to the chamber over the gate and wept. And as he went, he said thus, O my son Absalom, my son, my son Absalom, if only I had died in your place, O Absalom, my son, my son. God the Almighty shows us to love and mourn for those who cause trouble to us. David grieved and mourned for Absalom as a father, even when Absalom tried to kill him and plotted wicked against David for position, power, and fame. God's love for us is the same, even with sinful fallen nature, when we do evil in disobedience, that causes God our Heavenly Father to grieve for us. However, if we repent and turn to Him, He willingly forgives us. May we repent and return to our Savior and seek Christ with all our heart to please Him in all that we do as we are called children of the living God. As we read in Acts chapter 4 verses 25 and 26, Who by the mouth of your servant David have said, Why did the nations rage and the people plot vain things? The kings of the earth took their stand, and the rulers were gathered together against the Lord and against his Christ. May we, as children of the living God, always love our Heavenly Father and obey his will. We will live a life which is holy and acceptable to him in believing in his Son, Jesus, who gave himself for us on the cross of Calvary. Praise be to our wonder-working God. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for the privilege of your time in watching the videos and being part of Living God community. God bless you all abundantly as we are all created to be holy and happy in Jesus. Amen.